Let's see if we can use self-assembling wires to solve a maze. I have some stainless steel beads that are connected to a positive electrode, and then the maze is filled with castor oil. At the end of the maze is a negative electrode. This creates a potential gradient through the maze so that the balls self-assemble together. Let's see if they can solve the maze on their own. Sometimes the wires cheated by climbing over the walls. The reason this happens is the balls get statically charged so that they repel each other and they shoot off the ends, then they lose their charge and get attracted back to the negative electrode again. Now because of the corners of the maze, the balls needed a little help, but they eventually got there. Once it reaches the other electrode, the balls all just stay in place with the connected circuit and you can see it sparking in between the connected circuit line. It did it, it reached the end.